Hey, so let's talk about the views tool. This is where you get into something similar to animation, how to create a movement in your environment that's automatic. It just plays your movement that you set. So you become the director of how you want your model viewed. Views are over here on the right hand toolbar just past the midpoint and it looks like one of those hollywood like scene one take two action flat boards or whatever they're called so when you open that you'll see these different um perspectives on your model you don't have to worry about that right now if you click on one of these it'll take you to that perspective but this plus symbol here <clears throat> this plus symbol is adding a scene so think about this each one of these scenes is how you're going to move to that moment in your model. And then you're gonna choose where you're gonna move after that. And you're gonna control how fast you're gonna get there. So if you hit plus, and this is the scene that you want to start viewing your model in, hit a plus symbol. And here comes your first scene, scene one. There, this is your starting point. Now, assume that you wanted to go out there under, under the um, that arch, a little bridge. This is your starting point. Zoom down toward that little bridge and orbit down low as if you wanted to look under this bridge at that avatar's feet. Now you're in a mouse's perspective, low to the ground. Go ahead and hit the plus symbol and add scene two. This is your second scene in your series of movements. Now, what if you went under the bridge like a mouse? Put your mouse somewhere that it can um, hone in on and start rolling forward. Look at that, you're like a little mouse. And then you stop here. This is your scene three, hit plus, add scene. Now you've got three moments. You have your starting point back a bit. You have your second scene looking in a mouse's perspective under that little arch and you moved under. Now I know you don't probably have these things in your environment, but that's not the point. The point is pick moments, positions in this environment that you wanna to move to, and then I'll show you how to control it. So now I can orbit over here and pan. You could actually go into this, I can go into this little house. Add scene. Go into this house, zoom in a little bit, and you can go into anything that you've created. And you have to adjust it a little bit, like orbit and pan adjustments just to square up on a moment from the position inside of this thing. So that's kind of cool. If I could get that word together in there. There. And then add scene. And then I'll show you what I mean. You can make an obstacle course with all of your stuff. You could move through these objects and back again. It'd be cool if we had the time, but you can play around with that later. Now, hit the plus, uh, hit the play symbol, and it will take you back to your first scene and move at a certain rate. And I'll show you how to control that. Hit play. Now it goes back to scene one, and it shows you right here which scene it's scrolling through. Scene two. Here's our mouse's view under the arch. Scene three. Moving over to the door, scene four, going inside, scene five, and then I could go out from there and all of that. And then it keeps playing that whole thing in a loop. 